in shader. But I mean, seriously, it's just amazing to be able to get that emotion in the eyes. It's really hard. So hello. I'm Alex Evans from Media Molecule. And um, Michael asked us to just give a little insight into our creative process over the last few years at our studio. And you know, when we first heard about the PlayStation 4, we began thinking, what can we do to turn creative gaming and take it to the next level? Because that's what Media Molecule was founded to do. It was to use this amazing device to bring the creativity of every PlayStation user to the fore. And creativity takes many forms these days, whether it's taking a picture, cosplaying as Kratos, or 3D printing a customized character. It's easier than ever to show off your skills. And with the internet, you can reach millions of people. So creation is everywhere, but it can feel kind of fractured and complicated. And so we thought, how can we cut through all the crap? And we realized there's a simple way of thinking about all of this. What we wanted to do was let you record your dreams. Think about that for a second. Record your dreams. You see, the PlayStation 4, for us at Media Molecule, should be the creative console. It's the place you go to be inspired. It's the place you go to experience other people's dreams or to make your own. It's the place you go to create. And the only question for us was how. When we looked at how people create digitally, especially in 3D, things just haven't changed in the last five or 10 years. As a graphics programmer, vertices, textures, UV mapping, they've been the bane of my life and the artists I work with for many years. I call it the tyranny of the polygon. And so we asked ourselves, how could PlayStation 4 change this? How could the insane power per dollar that only a next-gen console deliver, how can we sweep away the techie mess? How can we redefine digital making and overcome the tyranny of the polygon? So we've done two years of research into this, from motion capture to stereo cameras. So we've done two years of research into this, from motion capture to stereo cameras to advanced user interfaces, touch interfaces. Basically, we tried everything. And it got more and more complicated, more and more space age. It just did not feel like recording dreams at all. And then we discovered that the single most powerful, accurate, and precise tool for 3D creation was right under our noses. It was the Move Controller. Now, finally, at last, after a troubled relationship, we've completely fallen in love with this thing. Dear Move Controller, I'm sorry. It's taken us so long to realize this, but we're going to marry you with the power of the PlayStation 4. We are going to revolutionize making. You're great. So one of the first things we built with this was a sculpting tool. And we've been using it for a while now. Once we stopped thinking in terms of memory budgets, schedules, pixels, we forgot about the technology, and we just started doodling, just sketching, put that at the heart of our creative process. A really lovely thing happened. We started having real fun making, collaborating, sketching, remaking. It doesn't matter where you start out, because you can take a left turn at any time that inspiration strikes and go somewhere even cooler. It's a free-form creative journey that I think of a little bit like cloud watching, except that you can reach in at any time and change and shape it to whatever's in your head. Behind me, you can see a time lapse of one of our sculpts playing back literally as it was made, because we record every single move that you make. And because it's such a quick and free-form thing, before we knew it at Media Molecule, we had made hundreds of these things. Imagine this multiplied from our tiny staff to the thousands and millions of brilliant PlayStation users online. Every single one of these was made entirely with the Move Controller. And it's a kind of performance. You're able to put down your ideas as fast as you can think of them. It's this combination of the PlayStation 4's power with the Move's unique accuracy, which allows us to ditch all of the 2D fiddly camera controls and nasty user interface. It makes 3D sculpting easy for beginners and deep for advanced creators. And if you're like me and haven't quite mastered sculpture yet, then we're going to allow you to use the creativity of all of these people to collage and create ever larger sets, game levels, stories, with the really the simplest possible interface. You just hold your controller and click to assemble your dream. Of course, this isn't just about sculpture and collage. With, with PlayStation 4, with the creative console, we wanted to change making in every way, whether it's music, gaming, or storytelling. And the point is, it's fast to create. What you're about to see was recorded live in one take, 
It's someone's dream brought to life with PlayStation 4.